In this Blender tutorial, I will give you an example when to use the chord spear rather than using the UV spear. So I'm going to add first UV spear, shift A, mesh and add UV spear. Then keep this UV spear little bit side, then shift A, mesh and then add a rounded cube and operator preset should be chord spear and keep it little bit side. Now we have one UV spear and one chord spear. Now select both and scale them along the z-axis as like this then go to the edit mode turn on your x-ray mode and select this bottom faces and then delete them now we got this dome kind of form ok shade smooth it and shade smooth it now add subd modifier on both and increase the subd count up to 2 ok you can see their topology one has a complete chord based topology and this one has tries. Now I want to create boolean on these spears. First try to create the boolean on the UV spear. Before adding booleans you need to apply scale. So select UV spear, control A and then apply scale. Then go to the edit mode and select faces. I'm going to select these faces. And then press I for the insert operation. Use the loop tool and then circle option. Then scale it down and then press I for the insert operation one more time and then E to extrude it and then use the insert operation select this face loop and use the insert operation so I created this small boolean at here now I just need to take its symmetry so I can select everything mesh and then symmetrize take the symmetry along the x axis and y axis as like this ok now same kind of booleans add on this chord spear so control A apply the scale and select these faces and then press I for the insert operation use the loop tool scale it down little bit use the insert operation and then E to extrude it and then use the insert operation select these faces use the insert operation one more time so I got this one more boolean I got this boolean at here. Now same steps, select everything, mesh, symmetrize, take the symmetry, select everything, mesh, symmetrize and take the symmetry along the x and y axis. And you can see I got these booleans. These booleans are little bit away and this little booleans are little bit close to the center. Now take them close to each other. Ok. And now we can understand why to use the chord spear rather than using the UV spear. Just go to the matcap view and just observe the spear, your UV spear. You can see this pinching we are getting just because of its topology. Its topology, it's not the chord based topology. You can see here are triangles. You can see these are the triangles. We are not getting a right topology and that's why we are getting this pinching. And this is not happening. In this case because here you can see all the cards and we are getting good topology and we are not facing any kind of pinching issue you can see there so these are the fundamentals when to use which kind of object and how to start with the basics you want to use this kind of form and you want to create this kind of details then you should go with the UV sphere because you can't do that in the chord sphere but you want something like this, the booleans on the curve surface at anywhere, then you should go with the chord sphere. You can see their topology. So that's it for today. Thanks for watching. If you want more this kind of fundamental tutorials, then please hit that like button and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Bye bye. See so you next video. Take care.